An aging hero's peace of mind. When you were born, when you took your first breath, opened your eyes to gaze at the world for the very first time, you saw your mother, and then you saw me. An average man, feeling as naked as you were, shaking, sweating, completely unprepared for the first time in my life, knowing that my existence was now far more complicated than waking up on time, grocery shopping, paying bills, and scheduling dates and vacations. No, looking into those baby browns that screamed, I need you, woke me from 31 years of peaceful slumber, slapped me into reality. I was now a dad, and my baby needs a hero. Sacrifice was the word. I said goodbye to video games, spontaneous drives, staying up way too late while binging television and weekends at the bar to wind down after a long week at work. I traded in my guitar for a sword and shield so that I could be there for you whenever you needed me to protect you from the dark, the monster under the bed, so that you wouldn't be afraid to face an entire world of unknowns, no matter what challenges you faced as you navigated your first odysseys, my hand was yours to hold, and I swore to never let go. But one day, you did. You told me to lay my weapon down, that you were ready to pick it up, that you no longer wanted me to guide you on your journeys, that you'd kill your own boogeymen, I was more Don Quixote than Lancelot. You could see the dents and rust on my armor, that I was slowing down almost as quickly as you were speeding up, that your abilities would soon overtake mine, and the hardest part was that I knew it. You didn't need a hero anymore. Letting you go was terrifying. My worries never cease that I made mistakes along the way, that I didn't teach you enough, that I failed somehow to help you learn how to battle those dragons that you seem all too eager to slay. It's almost as frightening as accepting that there is nothing I can do to turn back time to when I could hold you in my arms, when you needed me to read you stories before bed, to teach you how to ride your bike, and before you decided to trust another to take care of your heart. But I trust that you know, even if my knees are a little weaker, that my hair is grayer, that I weigh a little more, and that I can't carry a spear as easily as I used to, my heart still beats. And until my dying breath, your old hero will always be here when you need me.